Hey guys, welcome to the World Astral channel. In this episode, I'm gonna share with you the quickest walking tour I've ever done. We'll stroll around Berlin city center and capture the most iconic spots. I came to Berlin to visit my close friend Alina, who now lives there. We've already been to the city four years ago and decided to repeat our itinerary. However, we skipped a few sites due to the lack of time. We started our day at Gustav Heinemann Brücke, a picturesque bridge that spans the river Spree. <laughs> Too much sun <laughs> for today. <laughs> From there, we made our way to the iconic Platz der Republik, which is home to the Reichstag building and the German parliament. The views of the city from here are simply breathtaking. If you have some spare time, you can enter the Reichstag building and enjoy the city view. Next up was the world-famous Brandenburg Gate, one of the most recognizable landmarks in Berlin. After the Berlin Wall was built, the Brandenburg Gate became a symbol of division because it was inaccessible to East and West Germans and was situated in a restricted area. The gate came to represent German togetherness after the wall came down. We then headed to the beautiful neighborhood, which offers many sites and shopping facilities, as well as exclusive apartments. We are actually repeating our path uh, that we did three years ago. <laughs> Here is one of the oldest and most prestigious universities in Europe, Humboldt University. For our late lunch, we stopped at Burgermeister. The prices were very affordable and the burgers were fantastic, honestly. The burger was so good, I cannot even stand up. Euphoria! Lust Garden is a beautiful park in the heart of the city that offers a peaceful respite from the hustle and bustle of Berlin. You'll notice an impressive Altes Museum, which is a treasure trove of ancient artifacts and works of art.
The Berlin Cathedral on Museum Island is Berlin's largest church and one of the major sites in the city center. The building originally consisted of the Sermon Church, Wedding Church and Memorial Church, which no longer exists today. The vibrant Alexanderplatz is the ideal location to experience the spirit of the city. The Alex, as it is called by Berliners, is the central square of the eastern city center and one of the most important sites of Berlin. Tourists from all over the world admire the square and its attractions, including the TV tower, the world clock and the fountain of friendship between nations. If you have more time in Berlin than I did, I would suggest including the East Side Gallery on your list. I hope you enjoyed this real quick walking tour around Berlin city center. I know there is much more to discover, so it's a good reason to come back again. Let me know if you've been to Berlin and what were your favorite spots.